Hey everybody, Ed here. Um, as you know, I'm working on the Aglaze River. Um, I need to correct myself on another note. Um, it's the Wave Plain Moraine, and then there's a couple of ridge moraines down south more, which I'll go there and work on them later. This is just fairly close to my house. We're on the Big Oglaze River, which is a tributary to the Mami uh, River, and um, I'm in between the the old side of Fort Jennings in the town of Fort Jennings and um, and down the, I believe the next port downstream is Fort Brown. I could be wrong though, but um, I'm in Putnam County or Putman Put Put Putman County and not Polding County and um, I'm running a bucket full of material. I ran a bucket full of material. Um, as you can see here, I, I've been cleaning out that area really good. Um, some of those holes right there and vacuumed up some stuff and broke apart the bedrock over here, broke it apart. So, um, um, to clean it up better and just got a little more to do to fully clean this ledge. And the gravels was pretty, pretty, um, packed. Um, I met a really cool gentleman today from the U.S. Geological Survey. He was a hydraulic technician and was really nice. His name was Al. Quite the guy. I really enjoyed the conversation I had with him and he was very polite and, and answered all my questions. No problem. Um, he was measuring the water flow uh, um, through the river and there's a gauging station down, not far from here on this river and that might give you some hints to where I'm at um, I don't want to get into too much detail but I had <laughs> if I don't get no gold at all I, I had a real good find anyway um, if you see that Adena point there in my uh, in my pan, along with a bunch of quartz and stuff, but this is a real nice woodland point. Um, it's a Adena. You can tell by the way it was faceted down here and made. Um, but it's from the Woodland Error, the um, Woodland, um, so I forget what dates and all, but I can check my books and let you know in my, um, in my um, um, description later tonight when I put this on. It's October 7th of 2010. Put that down there. I don't want to lose that or break it. But uh, as you can see, I, I've cleaned all the way from over here all the way. And when it dries up a little more, if it does while I'm here, I'm going to vacuum some more. And finish cleaning that up all the way up to there. Um, and classify these two. I'm not using my half inch anymore. Um, I'm just using this quarter inch one. 
and going from there, <coughs> then over here, I don't have tons of water flow. See how this crack on this bedrock's doing really good? It's just the right, just the right angle and stuff. It's a must. I should check that. And right in here, that's, you can see the ledge right there, where the sun is. It comes down along here. That's, that's all a, an old quarry like I was telling you before. But, um, sorry about that. I'm going to take this off the tripod. But, here's where my sluice is set up. And I'm running my materials through my sluice. This ain't the fastest stream. Uh, I've been letting it run. And, um... The water's running even slower than yesterday. I might have a couple specks. They're a little bigger than yesterday. But okay, that seems to be working those riffles a little bit. But if you you can see right there, there's a couple of specks that look pretty promising. But I'm letting that material go through. Um, here's the area where I'm at. It's really nice. Really nice. Real, I really like this area for fishing and all kinds of stuff. But, I've caught some nice bass out of there. Um, it isn't even all that deep really either. It gets deeper towards that tree over there. But I've caught some nice fish here. And even some nice fish in here. But... that back on the tripod but I'm gonna get to work and finish this off and I'd like to thank um, Al Al Dillenberg um, a hydraulic technician um, from the U.S. Geological Survey, who I met today here on the river, who was a super guy, a really good guy, I'd like to say thank you again for um, answering all my questions and being great help. And I don't know if I'll get you in trouble or not. Uh, Thanks for the hat. <laughs> but, um, <coughs> on that note, I'm going to hurry up and blaze through this stuff and run it through the sluice. Then let that clean up a little bit. Then I'm going to pan it out and hopefully I'll have some pretty decent flakes or specks or whatever. But I'm sure I'll find something, you know. So, until then, this is Ed Marvin saying see ya.